Hello everyone, a very warm welcome to my weekly update. Um, I'm here in North Wales. I was visiting members in Montgomeryshire this morning and Merry Honoured this afternoon. As you can see, this fabulous Welsh landscape. This has been a long and overdue visit that was meant to happen back in the summer, then sadly got postponed because of the passing of Her Majesty the Queen. And so it's wonderful to finally be here. I feel like I've been touring the whole of the country this week and it's been quite a, a massive week actually because the environment plan, the EIP, um, was launched earlier on in the week. Huge implications I have to say for farmers. Um, the budget that we have at the moment doesn't look like it will remotely cover the sides of what will be needed um, going forward. It's a massive expectation of farmers. Um, I'm hoping at our conference that a lot of this will be brought to life by the Secretary of State, Therese Coffey and Mark Spencer, the Farming Minister. So it feels like absolutely critical times, but we are the very proud union of England and Wales. And so to be here today discussing trade deals, implications, how we, we get a bigger bang for buck effectively working together, whether that's in Cardiff or in London, is really, really important. Of course, facing into so many of the same challenges here, and indeed, in, in the upland environment, as the farmers in England are facing exactly the same challenges, the uncertainty of, of not knowing what will be coming next, and the importance of our grasslands, as you can see behind me, low input grasslands, they're really going to matter for sequestering our carbon. It's not all about trees, as many would have you believe, and that has been a lot of the theme of the discussion here. So as ever, wherever you are, please do take care, and I really look forward to speaking to you again. Thanks.